the thing about the NFL is it's greater than anything you could ever imagine. Like whatever you dream the NFL, you know, all the good stuff you think about, like it's better than that. And and, and it's worse than anything you could imagine because <laughs> there's very few guys in the NFL that daily their job isn't on the line or you're judged on your performance. And so really it's it's the antithesis of the, of the Christian walk. The Christian walk is you're justified because of what Christ did and now go out and, and try to live your life to the best of your ability, do everything you zip onto the Lord. Whereas in the NFL, it's the opposite. Do everything you can, and even that might not be good enough. You know, So it's like you have to constantly battle not putting your identity in the game, your identity in football or what a coach might say about you or what the fans might say about you or your teammates might say about you. You have to continue to fight that. But if you're mature enough and you take it as, man, what a great opportunity to grow in the Lord. It's every day. It, every day you're going to have opportunities to grow in the Lord because there's going to be temptations that you can't imagine. There's going to be a coach that just doesn't like you, and, and you got to continue to say, you know what, I'm going to be here as long as God wants me to be here. And it's a gr- it's a fake growing experience. And so, but then on you know, the other side, it's getting the chance to be teammates with with guys like Des Bryant or or Joey Galloway or Brock Heward or Josh McCown or. or Calvin Johnson, I mean, you know, you get to see some of the greatest athletes in the world, and uh, and that's a lot of fun. And then competing at the highest level is a tremendous opportunity, too. So 